Hey, Diamond Hill CrossFit, just finishing up my snack. It was an orange today. And this is also just a reminder, still during this time period, we wanna to try to be eating as many fruits and veggies as we can, eating whole foods, real foods. All right, let's get to the workout for Thursday. So we're gonna start with some core work, part one. We're gonna do 10 Dracula sit-ups, then a 20 second hollow hold, and then 10 plank up downs. So there's about a 90 second rest in between. You're gonna do four rounds. Then for part two, we have a 12 minute AMRAP. It's gonna start with 80 lateral hops over a dumbbell. If you don't have a dumbbell, you just do 80 lateral hops over a line. Then 60 air squats, and then 40 single arm dumbbell push press, and you're gonna switch arms every 10 repetitions. So the equipment you're gonna need, a yoga mat, a rower if you're gonna row for your warm up, a dumbbell or a kettlebell, PVC pipe or something similar, a broom, a band, and a lacrosse ball. For this workout, it's a higher volume workout, so you don't wanna redline in that first round. Um, and you want to choose a challenging weight for the push press if you have it. If you don't, you have to stay on the lighter side. You just want to try to move through those push presses quicker. Um, for our express class, you're going to start with a 200 meter run or row. One minute of up, down, dog down. A prayer stretch one minute. Pass through for a minute. You're going to do a similar warm up as for the main class for specific. And the wad as well is going to be that 12 minute camera. So for the warm up, you're going to do a 400 meter run or row. Then we'll work on some mobility. We're going to do a bottom squat hold and some ankle rotations for one minute. Then up, down, dog, down, up. I always mess that step up, up. Down dog, up dog for a minute. Prayer stretch for a minute. And then pass through. For our specific warm up before the wad, we're going to do two rounds of 20 lateral hops, 10 air squats, and then 10 single arm dumbbell push press. That's do five on the right, five on the left. After we finish this workout for cool down, we're going to roll out our um, shoulders and 